It's now been five weeks since that fire at a storage warehouse in Etna, and now for the first time today, people are now seeing the extent of the damage. Lindsay Ward spoke with some of them. For people who have a vehicle stored inside this warehouse where there was a massive fire, have been waiting for this day. It took five weeks for them to finally get their car back. It's like seeing the Titanic being raised, <laughs> and you see what it looks like when it comes up. One by one, from luxury to sporty, vehicles were being driven or towed out this morning. The paint's the main thing. I mean, a detail would be maybe close to a thousand. A paint job will be fifteen to twenty thousand. That's Michael Boretsky already figuring out what needs to be done to get his Ferrari back to where it was. He said his car is in much better shape than he originally thought. It was on May 8th when a seven alarm fire heavily damaged the Store Express warehouse on Butler Street. Besides vehicles, antiques and motorcycles were stored inside. Many even ran their businesses out of the warehouse. It's been a slow process for people to check out their valuables due to the current structure of the building. It looks pretty bad. A lot of melted parts, exterior. Bill Lapp was able to drive his Mercedes SUV out of the warehouse, but after closer inspection, he noticed his vehicle was not really ready for the road and decided to haul it away to an auto body shop. He tells KDKA he had two vehicles inside the warehouse. I had a car on the other side and we were able to do the same thing. And that's in a restoration shop. So I have two Mercedes and they were both in the fire. Reporting in Etna, Lindsay Ward, KDKA News.